I'm Laurie Thomas with the University of Kentucky Forestry and Natural Resources Extension, and I'm here with the tree of the week, the Washington Hawthorn. Washington Hawthorn, Crataegus phenopyrum, is a deciduous tree of the Rosaceae family. The genus Crataegus is difficult to identify because there are more than 150 different arborescence forms recognized in the United States, and many of these species hybridize. Washington hawthorn, or Washington thorn as it's considered, is one of the most attractive hawthorns and is easily distinguished from the other hawthorns. It is noted for its attractive flowers, bright red fruits, and fall color. Washington hawthorn is a small, low-branching tree that grows about 25 to 30 feet tall with a nice rounded crown. The tree has spike-like thorns that are usually about 1 to 3 inches long. It is an important wildlife tree and widely used in landscape plantings. Washington Hawthorne's range includes the eastern half of the United States and it has been introduced in Canada. It's scattered in central and western Kentucky. It prefers well-drained soils and is adaptable to a variety of pHs. It will grow in partial shade and with best flower and fruit production in less shade, however. It is tolerant of urban pollution and is widely planted as a small specimen tree or in groupings to form a large thorny hedge. The leaves of Washington Hawthorn are deciduous and they are simple and alternately arranged as you can see in the photo. The leaves are ovate and triangular with lobed and serrated margins. They are one to three inches long and one fourth to two inches wide. Leaves typically have three to five lobed margins and are dark green and glossy above and lighter below. The branch has a slightly curved three inch long spiked thorns and fall leaf color is showy ranging from orange to red to burgundy and purple. Washington Hawthorn is monoecious with showy white flowers. The flowers are in flat top flower clusters of maybe about 50 flowers per cluster. The flowers bloom from April until June, with um, the blooms lasting about 10 days. The flowers are fragrant, and occasionally that odor can be unpleasant. The flowers are pollinated by bees, particularly our native bees, as well as midges. The fruit is a small, red, edible poem. The fruits are clustered in groups and are showy, bright red, and each poem is about a fourth of an inch across. Trees begin seed production between five to eight years, and the fruit is eaten by a variety of wildlife, including birds and mammals, and the seeds are dispersed by wildlife. The bark is thin and gray, and as the tree ages, it breaks into narrow scales. These scales fall off, occasionally revealing an orange-red inner bark. Although hawthorn species tend to be rather small, the wood can be well suited for smaller projects, but not on a commercial level. They are known for their flowers and their fruit. The wood is generally medium to moderately heavy and strong. The sapwood is cream colored and the heartwood is highly variable in color. Crataegus species are diffuse pores, and diffuse pore species have small vessel elements or cells called pores that are evenly distributed throughout each growth ring, whereas ring pore species such as our oaks have vessel cells that range in size from very large in the spring to very small in the, in the summer wood. Washington hawthorn is an important tree for wildlife. The flowers provide nectar for pollinators such as native bees and butterflies and hummingbirds. It is the larval host plant for the gray hair streak, the red spotted purple, and the viceroy butterflies. Songbirds like cedar waxwing, quail, wild turkey, and small mammals eat the fruit, and the dense branches provide nesting protection. Washington hawthorn is an attractive tree that is widely used as an ornamental tree in landscape plantings. It's used as a specimen tree or in groupings or even as a hedge since it tolerates heavy pruning. There are numerous cultivars that are thornless, including Princeton Sentry and Fastigiata. The champion, national champion Washington hawthorn as of 2021 is in Norfolk, Virginia. It's 37 inches in circumference, 21 feet tall, with a crown spread of 32 feet. The Kentucky Champion is in Fayette County on the Henry Clay Estate of Ashland. It is 26 inches in circumference, 29 feet tall, with a crown spread of 19 feet.
If you'd like to know more about Champion Trees, check out the American Forest National Champion Trees or check out the Kentucky Division of Forestry Champion Trees. Now for a few fun facts about Washington Hawthorne. The common name Hawthorne comes from the word haw, which means hedge in Old English. The fruit, while it's beautiful, is also edible and can be made into jelly or crushed to make a tea. It was introduced in English gardens because of its beauty in the 17th century and is still cultivated in England, France, and Germany. It was dubbed Washington Thorn when some cultivated stock from Washington, D.C. was taken to Pennsylvania for planting in the 1830s. The scientific genus name Crataegus is the Latin name for the hawthorn, and it comes from the Greek Crataegos, which means thorn tree, and Kratos, which means strength because of the strong wood. The specific epithet, phenopyrum, means with the appearance of a pear, and that's in reference to the foliage. I hope you get the opportunity to get out into your woodland, a local park, or neighborhood and enjoy the beautiful trees, including the Washington Hawthorne.